An anonymous employee inside the executive branch of the government is giving an insider's take on the biggest news of the day, and she's doing it on a San Diego-based podcast. It's got the clever title, Muller, She Wrote. Get it? 10 News reporter Travis Rice went to the North Park home where three women are making a show getting worldwide audiences. In a spare bedroom somewhere in the San Diego metro lies the latest award-winning political podcast. Uh, the podcast is in here. This is the home of Muller, She Wrote. Thank you. And this is the trio behind the podcast that's a million downloads a week and growing. Put some beans on it! They just won a Webby Award for news podcast, beating out major organizations like the Washington Post. We have uh, a lot of fans in the industry. It almost feels like we're the podcasters podcast. The three female comedians report on all things Mueller investigation while also riffing on it because they say cable news doesn't have their edge. They want a fresher take and they want uh, hope and they want... Uh, I think uh, the fact that we're female voices uh, also makes a difference. AG Jaleesa Johnson and Jordan Coburn say talking about the proceedings are just as helpful for them as their listeners. Being a part of the podcast has forced me to, to really just be in tune with the details of the news and not just catching the headlines. A lot of my friends, like, they read headlines. The podcast interviews many of the same newsmakers you see on networks and is known for its fantasy football approach to indictments. So we started the first podcast when the first indictments were dropped. And then AG thought, why don't we start a whole segment where each week we'll predict who's going to get indicted next. And who exactly is this AG? Well, I go by AG. I use a pseudonym. Well, you know, because I work for the federal government. Let's just say her boss in the executive branch is not a listener. I'm not allowed to talk no, about that talk about at this that. time. <laughs> but what they can tell you is they're going to keep talking about what they have been. We'll go on conceivably for a long time, honestly. It <laughs> yeah. can be at least through the rest of the year. Into 2020, I, yeah, yeah, election we'll season, I think. Yeah. Travis Rice, 10 News. Might have to become one of the million downloads a week. Yeah. Sounds interesting. interesting.